Okay. Here we go. Look at me. I have a black screen as well. You know, my neighbor is playing music so fucking loud that apparently it can wake up a Snorlax from 50 miles away. How do you define feminism? So, what is feminism to you? Feminism is women being treated the same as men in all areas of life. Well, hopefully you plan to go to war with the men as well, because apparently men are the ones who are drafted to war and not women. But hell, you want to grow a pair of balls? You might as well start by going to the fucking military. Believing that everybody is equal. And so is egalitarianism, but for some odd reason it's just not enough to become an egalitarianist. You have to become a feminist! Feminism is a movement that pushes for equality for men and women. But in practice, feminists have done everything but practice on what they preach. Feminism is not a bad word. Yet you feminists have no problem, you know, saying anyone who dares disagree with you must be a fucking MRAs because God knows only the MRAs would dare oppose feminism. As if saying that the only reason to even be a part of the MRAs is to be against women. It's not an insult. It's not just for women. It's not hatred of men. But even if it did, it wouldn't matter. Not about making women more important than any other gender. Or believing that women are better than men. Feminism is not about putting anyone down. But feminists like yourself constantly put down MRAs because they dare speak for men's rights. It's not hating women who adhere to certain beauty standards. But if she dares go on the internet providing dieting tips, and if she's not a feminist, she's fat shaming. Have a boyfriend or a husband. It's just us standing up for what we believe in and what truly is right. Same thing could be said about ISIS and, of course, the Nazis. I am a feminist because I am tired of feeling apologetic for being a woman. Wait, 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 wait. Somehow, like, almost every day in your fucking life, someone gets offended for you being a woman and therefore demands an apology for you being a woman. I, 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 it's amazing. It's, it's amazing that you're able to function normally let alone be able to tell the difference between your left hand and your right foot. Because everybody should be a feminist. If you actually practice what you preach, then yes, everyone should be a feminist. Unfortunately, you do not. Therefore, you nor anyone in the world should be a fucking feminist. Because I don't think society should dictate what being a woman means. And the men, right? No, 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 fuck the men, of course. No, no, no. You don't really care much about the men. <laughs> because I think jobs should be genderless. There are jobs that men have the advantage over, and there are jobs that women have the advantage over. By saying that there should be genderless jobs, you're basically saying that every job, regardless on whether or not it fits better for either gender, should be completely removed. Because I shouldn't have to worry about what I'm wearing saying more about me than what I'm actually saying. I am a feminist because I want to actively fight against the ideas that we've just accepted into society that are actually detrimental to women. And those ideas are what? What, how women are being portrayed in media? Even though we've done this a thousand fucking times on how... It's not sexist on how women are portrayed in the media, how they are portrayed in fucking ads. I mean, I really, really got tired of that shit. Feminism is important because women should be treated like humans, not like objects. And fuck the men. For serious issues like rape, sexual slavery, domestic violence. Feminism is helping women to be able to stand up for themselves, speak for themselves in a world where it's not always allowed. Two things. First, 
If a feminist starts speaking out their mind, especially if it's a female feminist, any form of criticism, they'll quickly hide their tails between their legs, shit bricks faster than Sonic the Hedgehog can run, and cry out misogyny, which then every fucking press in the world will then dehumanize their critics by stating they are nothing more than fucking sexist and no one should dare speak out against her. And second, nothing is stopping you from speaking out your own fucking mind. In fact, if anything, you are even more important power to speak thanks to those fucking white knights on the internet on where my children will have the same opportunities no matter what sex they are feminism is important so that women band together women are underrepresented in positions of power clearly you value gender more than someone's performance because every facet of every job in the industry I work for is dominated by straight white men because apparently diversity is more important than performance. Here's what I have to say to people that don't believe in feminism. What are you afraid of? I have a fear of heights and snakes. Yeah, that's what I fear. What do you fear? Even if you don't believe in feminism, feminists are still fighting for your rights. You know, that could be roughly translated into, look, you don't believe in Jesus Christ. So guess what? I'll be doing the praying for you. When you say that you don't believe in feminism, what you're saying is that you don't believe that men and women should be treated equally. WRONG! Feminism does not own the concept of equality. Egalitarianism does. To oppose equality, you must oppose egalitarianism, not feminism. My name is Carrie. My name is Chris. My name is Daisha, and I'm a feminist. My name is Macy, and I'm a feminist. My name is Abe. I come from a long line of feminists. You know, all those signs might as well just say, please join the hive mind so that way we can take away what's human of you away from you. And I'm proud to call myself a feminist. Well, that was fun, and also quite annoying.